Second half, they were at Old Trafford, and it's 1-0 to Manchester United, and like we said at the end of the first half, it was very well deserved. We'd just seen the replay of Yanzai's goal. It was, it was truly out of absolutely nothing. The situation did not screen goal, and somehow Yanzai managed to poke it in. <laughs> I'm, I'm still stunned by how good that goal is for United. If it turns out to be the game winner, it's well deserved. I think it will earn the title of game winner, even if United do score again, so... Goal at St Mary's, Southampton have conceded against Stoke City, Southampton nil, Stoke City 1. Manchester City apparently still leading at, um, whoever they were playing, I completely forgot. <laughs> His pains for United. Now they've got some crucial games coming up, like we said at the beginning of the broadcast, they are two games in hand over the leaders and cleverly takes a shot. Well, Tom Cleverly was one of the scorer of that absolute belter out of absolutely nowhere in the uh, Colchester Epic match. <laughs> it actually forced a stain out of Stang's board. It's going to be a corner. United here. Let's see to take it. It's a header. Oh, it's at the post. And well back. And uh, header off the post there. And here's Evans. Cleverly done. Need to go backwards. Let's see it. And United you know, just attempt to keep the ball. There's uh, Hemwood, then he's going to get tackled and goes back for it. <laughs> and to Kagawa. Beverly. Beautiful movement. Valencia. Saved by Sensor. Fantastic play from United in this, uh, in this game. Flashes of brilliance and the goal was just as well. It was great build up, but Yanazai's finish stole the show in that move. Oh, a great challenge. Cleverly tries to keep it, but uh, unfortunately, nothing doing. Manchester City 2 1 against Sunderland. It's a classic over there at the Etihad Stadium. There's Turan. There's Ben. The offensive laps by Evans giving the ball away. Look at the Manchester United defenders all over the ball hat, uh, the ball dribbler. Somehow full and get through. And uh, cleared away by, uh, I think it might have been Valencia. Manchester United's defenders all over the dribbler. Beautiful defence from United so far. He's been after tackled by Baines. It's going to be a full and throw. thrown out to uh, for Fulham but Baines is there again beautiful pass to Welbeck I don't even know if that was intentional don't think so Here come United with Valencia not just content to keep the ball at the moment Cleverly is muscled away from the ball but Cleverly going back for it it's almost like it's contagious it's every time United lose the ball recently they have the people and they just go and get it back uh, Villa Park, Ashton Villa conceded against West Ham, but Villa still have the lead by two goals to one there. And, and now finally United get back on the ball with Valencia, who has to pass it out under the pressure. Understandable. Now it's Ben for Fulham, who's looking out of position there, but Valencia goes and gets the ball away again, but again, Fulham has the throw in. And tries to He's out of pressure and out of body posture and uh, head up. And Fulham showing some intent there with Tarat, but uh, nothing doing. To head up. It's an ambitious one. But uh, here doesn't even have to move. Parker. Because uh, I said it's well back, but nothing doing there. Cleverly. And Wilbur's going to shoot. It's going to get blocked. And Cleverly's going to come up with it. He's going to force a save out of Stones ball. Beautiful play from Cleverly to read it. The new number eight. Proving his worth there. And Cleverly was off balance, it has to be said. But uh, it was worth the shot. And uh, Anya Nenazai, the star, will take the corner. It's going to come out to Jones. And it's off the line, I think. 
No, they're back with Evans though. Have a look. Let's see it. Manchester United all over this game. Healthy, a good tackle. Oh, just can't go anywhere with it though. Let's see a good toe poke and well that comes up with it. Good save, Stanisburg again. Stanisburg is uh, denying, uh, denying United further goals here. And as I look the corner, to somebody. I believe was thinking about hitting it, and was. Right. And then to Baines. I think they're looking for the boy with yellow shoes. Or boots, rather. But uh, and it seems to be nowhere. It's not even on the pitch. And it's in for a while. Baines again. Jones. And Jones gives it away. Interestingly, that. Jones gets it back. And a foul called against Kasami, I think. Oh no, it's offside against Kasami, my apologies. And I had the ball in any case. Evans. I believe. And uh, Aaron Hibbert is uh, blended in there on the top of the. Just below, just below the wing position there. Right back to Valencia. Brilliant move. Cleverly is onside. And uh, Valencia. Was trying to use him, but the pass was wayward. You would have thought Valencia would have gone himself, and Skegger's ball was being a thorn in the side of Manchester United in the second half. After conceding the stunner by Yanazai, Skegger's ball has been on form. And it's the scoreboard that counts at the end of the match. And so far, United are leading it by one goal to nil. And Yanazai with that absolute stunner out of absolutely nothing. He's cleverly. Green Cagle and now Wilbeck. And uh, the ball is uh, stuck, but uh, from Gathering. United just with the desire to get the ball every time they lose it. But you can't beat a team like that. Leveling. Oh, the pass was uh, picked off by Ben Arthur, but here comes, here comes Tom Cleverly again. United with just such desire to get the ball back. Oh my god. Henwood here, and Henwood almost giving it away. He's trying to push the run back forward back after it. Now Yanazai again. Now Valencia. He definitely has no one down there. In United's case, both the wingers are up top. To Everett, you know, we just need to probably slow the game down a little bit. Cleverly looking for Welbeck and not finding him, unfortunately. Here's uh, Hemwood, who's uh, tackled by Sidwell. Uh, run with it, Steve, because someone's going to come back and get you if you don't. And uh, Sidwell passes it. Gives chase and gets back into position. United just all over the ball dribbler every time. Every time United had the ball, they go back and get it. It's been a stunning defensive performance so far. Oh, it's a beautiful determination shown by the Fulham winger, but it's cleared by Evans for a corner. Or throw in, rather. <laughs> Dimitar Berbatov is coming on for Darren Ben, substitute, and uh, De Gea is going to gather that. So Berbatov's going to play the final 10 minutes against his former club. Manchester City have cemented their win at the Etihad Stadium, 3-1 now against Sunderland. My back. Uh, referee looking to play advantage. My back again, Valencia, who's been all over. Then right now as Henwood takes a shot and poor Aaron Henwood just cannot get a goal. He's trying so hard. Here he is again. Henwood's going to shoot. He's deflected again. <laughs> Every time Aaron Henwood shoots, it's met by somebody. What's going on? Referee. Referee is coming over. It's a booking for... It's a booking for Garvey, I think. Oh, it's for the earlier challenge on Werbeck, I think. That's what the referee played advantage for. Well, it doesn't look like much in that. 
in all honesty, it looked, yeah, a bit unusual. Now it's like with the corner, it's going to be out as far as uh, and we're here, he's going to think of the better person and pass it, but they go back to him. Henwood really wants a goal, just to break his scoring duck of hands, anything right now, anything would do. He's only scored against Wicked of the Community Shield. <laughs> Every time he shoots, someone's there to stop him, whether it be John Ruddy of Norwich or anybody really. Henwood had that personal battle against John Ruddy of Norwich and uh, just couldn't pass him. And here he is again. Aaron Henwood has got the determination look in his eyes now. Stagginsborg now denies him. <laughs> Aaron Hemmer must be wondering what he has to do to score right now. Plenty <laughs> with the corner. We, we can sit here and uh, joke, but the poor kid is not having any luck in front of goal this year. No idea what it is. And Hemmer is uh, playing his socks off and not getting anything rewarded for it. It's Kagawa though. Only try to go forward again. Oh, Kasami. The tackle on cleverly, but United again with the absolute desire to get the ball back. Never has let it run right down to the uh, full corner. The, uh, the left hand corner for Fulham, that is. United try to get it back again. United's defense has been the main stalking point today. Sigwell step out and steps him with there. Fulham could have a chance. Saved by De Gea. Brilliant save. Three minutes of added time, and United had a scare there. As well, back Valencia going in front of it. The counter attack for United, and Valencia gets stopped in his tracks. And uh, Hemel was looking at that ball. And there's going to be an advantage play for Fulham here. Over the top. And as I tries to stick a foot out, but bubbles and bounces. It's Fulham again. United would be very cool to concede now. They're led by an absolute stunning goal, and uh, what is it? It looks to be. It looks to be. Uh, what's this from Welbeck? It's the tussle with Ganabi again. With Ganabi booked, I think. Well, 90 minutes are up. David De Gea saved United right at the end. And United win. It's absolute. It wasn't an absolute cruise, but they win in any case. That's United style. David De Gea saves them at the end. The score remains one 0 from the hands. I stunned it in the first half. United had to work for it at the end there, but it's still one 0 to United, and that is what matters. Another three points with a game still in hand over the leaders.